This lake at the Maker's Mark Distillery at Loretto, part of the Beam Suntory family, is where the water comes from that goes into making their bourbon. Protecting the natural resources around the distillery is a priority for Jason Nally you know, at I mean, Maker's Mark. Trying to make sure that we use each drop of water respectfully um, and that as rain falls onto our property, that the vegetation that it encounters, the soil that it encounters, uh, that we have that um, in the best condition possible. Uh, Nally's title at Maker's Mark is environmental champion um, and, and one he takes seriously uh, because of Beam's global initiative for water sustainability throughout all their brands. Oh, there he is. Oh, there's three. One, two, three. Beam reached out to students at the University of Kentucky's Water Resources Research Institute about working with them as interns on water sustainability. And one of the things Beam was concerned about was do they have extra sediment coming in and so forth. So what we're doing is I've been working with the students and taking a lot of the stuff that I teach in my stream restoration course and actually bringing it out here into the field so they can apply it. We're definitely getting dirty here at Beam. We one of the of UK on students about working about on the project is civil engineering Beam. graduate Beam. student Go Austin Gilbert who says the students spent a lot of time walking streams in the Long Lick watershed near the distillery. But we get to go in and look at uh, what's going on in the environment, things that you don't get to see from a day to day unless you're really out there in the field. Jason Nally said they value the data collected by the students, which is important to their success. As a water professional, it's really exciting to see um, an industry that is as um, successful in Kentucky as it is, but to see an industry that has a sustainability focus. What's been fascinating in this uh, process is really learning how important uh, water is to the, to the bourbon industry when you start to actually study the complexity of the distillation process and just the, the various ways that water uh, is involved. It, it's, it's very insightful. From the University of Kentucky College of Agriculture, Food and Environment, I'm Jeff Franklin reporting.